This video will look at the graphs of circles. For our year 10, we're keeping the circles pretty simple. The equation of a circle is written as x squared plus y squared equals a number. The basic case is when we make x squared plus y squared equal 1. And this is the circle that it produces. We find it's a circle at the centre at 0, 0 has a radius of one unit. You see the highest it goes in any direction from the centre is of one unit. That's the definition of a circle is if you know where it starts, the centre, and then it's the points all the same distance away from that centre. You can see the outer points of this. Next thing we'll do we'll change the value of R to 4. Next thing we'll do is change the value of R to 2. So we'll see that now the circle has a radius of 2, but the equation is actually this x squared plus y squared equals 4, which is actually 2 squared. You can see by the outer points, this 0, 1 has now become 0, 2. Point 1, 0 is now 2, 0. The point negative 1, sorry, the point 0, negative 1 is now the point 0, negative 2, and the point, um, the point negative 1, 0 is now negative 2, 0. Alright, so then we'll draw well, the next one on our notes is x squared plus y squared equals 9, so we need to change that value of the radius to 3, the 3 squared being 9, so x squared plus y squared equals the radius squared. So when I've made the value of, um, so now the radius is 3, still got a centre, 0, 0, and every point is 3 units. So if I go out here somewhere, that length still is 3 units. And the next one we would do is make R is 4, it makes the equation x squared plus y squared equals 16. And the 4 out of points involve 4 and 0 because the centre is still at 0, 0. If I increase the radius, you see the circle gets bigger, so if I go right out here, I'm going to go 10. So the equation where the radius is 10 is x squared plus y squared equals 10 squared, 100. And the points are all 10 units out from the centre, 0, 0. And the original graph is there. What would happen if we made R 2.5? Well, the square of 2.5 is 6.25, and each point would be 2.5 units from the centre, 0, 0. Now you'll need to answer the rest of the questions on the work booklet and the questions on the work plan. Thank you.